Hey guys, JNS here. What is up? Uh, I started this gameplay a little late. It was a live recording, but in Kill Confirmed and TDM on Resistance, you guys want to throw a grenade right at that wall and you'll get, pick up a dub easy. And right here, I camped the dog tag for another kill. But um, anyways, guys, this is a 68 and 7 or 67 and 8 gameplay. I was so close to 70 kills and I choked at the end and I, um, I was using the P90 at the beginning and I just, I was getting wrecked by these guys. So I went full tryhard and used my favorite class in the game which is the ACR Silence with Extended Mags with Quick Draw, uh, Slide of Hand, and Stalker. So I was just lighting them up, and I think three or four of them rage quit because I was I was just absolutely destroying them. Predator, I was using Predator, Reaper, uh, Pavlo. My Pavlo got shot down every time. This easily could have been 80 kill game if I was running AC-130. Um, but um, anyways, I just want to talk about why some of your, your favorite commentators are struggling to get good gameplays. And that's because in Black Ops, a lot of a lot of commentators they would pull a host or have a really good connection, and they would rely mostly on their on their uh, kill streaks to do all the work. I mean, chopper dogs. I remember one kid saying 15 kills with a chopper gunner was bad. I averaged like seven, but like most of these most of these commentators that were really good at Black Ops are struggling in this game because their kill streaks can't get can't get them all the kills. So. Yeah, it's frustrating them. This game is a little more gun on gun, and like I said, I enjoy this game when I'm playing on a four bar. I can be really, really aggressive. I mean, like super aggressive. And right here, I'm starting off seven and four. I think I did one more time, and then I go on like a 53 tear or something. I was really close to an MOAB, but I got shot in the back because I, uh, I, I wasn't paying attention. I should have picked off another guy before I turned around. But yeah, like I said, a lot of the commentators are struggling really bad in this game because their their gun skills isn't the best. Um, they rely mostly on kill streaks and uh, blackbirds to uh, do all the work. But my favorite commentator right now, uh, he's always been my favorite commentator just because of his gameplays, his fear crads. Uh, he has the best gun skill I think I've seen in MW3 so far. And that's why he keeps posting these beast ass gameplays. He also had a bad connection in Black Ops, so he relied mostly on his gun also. And then um, that, he was still getting 100 kill games on three bars. And now look at him, he's probably the best MW3 player out right now. So that that just shows you guys that a lot of these guys are going to struggle because they relied on their kill streaks doing all the work. And this game is mostly gun kills, gun kills and reaper kills. I actually get a lot of reaper kills. I'm really good at it now, and I highly suggest running that even if you're struggling. I suggest running five, seven, nine. Um, Payload is a good is a good uh, kill streak, but everybody seems to shoot it down for some weird reason. I don't know why, but mine always gets shot down. So um. I'm going to upload one of my subscribers videos. He got an MOAB with a sniper rifle and it's on his channel. So I'm going to be uploading that later this week. Probably maybe Friday, Saturday. I'm not too sure yet. Uh, it was really good gameplay. And it, it, 25 kill gun streak with a sniper is pretty beast in my opinion. So I'll be uploading that. And this whole com I'm not going to be talking for the rest of the commentary. I'm going to just end it uh, probably around 7 minutes, 6 minutes. I, I really don't feel like talking. And I'm not going to put any music on. So if you guys want to just pause the video, go to a... Yeah, Click, uh, get a music song on that you enjoy listening to. Just put it on and then watch the rest of the commentary. Uh, I mean the video. My bad. But anyways, guys, I just want to tell you guys my favorite class so far in MW3. And it could go both ways between the ACR and the SCAR-H. I like to run Silencer with Extended Mags just because it gives me more ammo when you use Extended Mags. I also use Quick Draw Pro, Slide of Hand Pro, and Stalker Pro. And when I'm using Stalker Pro, guys, you want to strafe. And what a strafe is, is you move left to right so you can dodge the enemy uh, shots. See, um, but right there wasn't a very good example. But with a Stalker Pro, especially on the submachine gun, you can strafe really, really well. Uh, just go left to right or just pick, go, uh, just take a quick side step to the left. And that will save you quite a bit. And also, guys, what I want to tell you guys with drop shot, uh, playing on tactical, not only do you, you can drop shot on tactical, but it really controls your body movements with your player. And what I mean by that is... Uh, you can really you can you can drop to the ground. You don't have to drop shot. You can drop behind cover quickly without getting your uh, finger off the thumbstick. Instead of pressing B to drop uh, drop your body down. So it's just another way to survive and to uh, drop shot. So uh, tactical layouts not just for drop shotting. It's just for survivability in my opinion. So always play on um, always play on tactical guys. If you guys aren't playing on tactical in this game, then you you probably won't be doing that well. As you, you could probably be doing a lot better. So, um, play on tactical. And sorry if I sound hoarse. I got allergies at the wazoo again. Um, this morning, oh, this morning was a. I woke up like at eight thirty. I don't have class till twelve thirty. I I don't wake up till eleven. So I was pretty pissed when I woke up. But 
freaking we had a, a storm again, a lightning storm or a thunderstorm. Why do I say lightning storm? A thunderstorm in uh, where I live. And I've never heard uh, thunder so loud in my life. It was like three, I think three lightning bolts struck like right next to my house. It was pretty ridiculous. And then when I got on to go check my YouTube this morning, my uh, nothing was working. Like the router wasn't working or anything. So I was like, oh God, I fried it again. But uh, the, for some reason, the power surge was on, but it wasn't working. So I switched it off and then on and then it, it worked. So it was really weird. But right there, my teammate saves me surprisingly. But if you guys have any more questions about the... Um, about Modern Warfare 3, any tips I can give you guys? I'll be talking about more tips on different videos and um, rushing routes. I guess I'll be doing later, but right now I'm just I'm just focusing on gameplays and giving some more tips as I can uh, think of them. But right here, I'm just laying them out. And at the end of the game, I choke. I think I died like three times in a row with only getting one kill, so I was getting pretty frustrated. And you'll be able to see that I start knifing in the air and start shooting my gun randomly, which almost uh, gets me killed again. But as you guys can see, I'm just lighting them up, man. It was a team of four, and I really love how you can hear people, um, when you kill them, their reactions with a the mic. These guys were all bitching how I was killing them so fast, and they actually rage quit. There's like three or four of them, and they just backed out because I was smoking them too bad. But yeah, anyways, what was I wanted to talk about? Mm -hmm. um, I was, oh, I was going to talk about my favorite maps so far, and what's your guys' favorite maps? I really don't play 6v6 too much. Uh, so I don't play like on mission carbon or hard hat, but I'm going to start doing that for you guys to upload some more different maps. Um, so you guys can see on my channel set of these, uh, these ground war maps, but my, my favorite maps so far or are resistance, uh, bootleg and village. Those are the best three maps in my opinion. And I actually, li I like Baraka too, uh, when people don't camp in the back of the map, but I really like those maps, and I do not like Fallen at all. That second story building uh, next to B flag is just ridiculous. I mean, everybody and their mother camps there, but forgive me. I'm just all stuffed up, but I'm going to end the commentary right here, guys, and just put on a song that you know that last two minutes. So anyways, guys, I go 67 and 8 on Kill Confirmed using my favorite class, ACR, Silence, Extended Max, Quick Draw, Slide of Hand Pro and Stalker Pro, and make sure to strafe and make sure to play on tactical guys. But anyways, peace out. Hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, leave a like if you like. If you don't like it, leave a dislike, um, or tell me what I can improve on for you guys. And uh, peace out. Explosive decoy on the way. Best you will be online. You will be online. <laughs> Enemy UAV spotted. Friendly predator missile inbound. Explosive decoy on the way. Friendly Cobra inbound. Keep on them, we're winning this one. Hostiles jamming our radar. Kill confirmed. Friendly airstrike on the way.